All right, what's going on everyone? It is your boy Dylan, AKA Dilly VFX, and today I'm gonna be teaching you guys how to sync your clips the best way possible. We're literally just gonna get right into it. The only thing I ask is if you subscribe and like the video. We're gonna jump right into Sony Vegas. What I mean by unnecessary shit, I'm not gonna be like, so step one, get a song right here. Step two, grab your clip. Step three, make another audio track. So if I was starting this out, I would fade the audio just like this, as you guys can see. Voila. Wait for the beat drop. Out on All right, marker. So it's gonna be like. Okay, wait. Boom. 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 Wait. Okay. Basically, what I try to do is I listen and I visualize the gun sounds before I even put the clip. So it would be like, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Like, watch. Okay, so that'll be fire right there. Boom, boom. boom. Okay, fire right there. We got it on the beats right here. I just think it's on fire. So, basically, if I play this back and you guys listen, watch. That'll be fire. Okay, so now we got the clip. Now all I gotta do is drag my clip over here. I'm gonna delete the audio and use one of these gun sounds and then copy and paste it. You guys are gonna think this is like weird how I do it, but I'm gonna be copying and pasting the gun sound only right now just so I can like listen to it and then visually see it. You know what I mean? We need to turn these gun sounds up a little bit though. Volume, probably like here. That's better. That's way better. More clear. Okay, okay. And then right here. So let's... I already know it's gonna go hard. Bro, that's fire. Okay. Yep. I noticed though in the gun sounds, there's like this uh, rolling feed sound you hear. So we're gonna fade this. Cause we do not want that. So now that we have our gun sound synced, all I gotta do is drag the footage over now and then cut and you guys will see how I do this now. You know, everyone's gonna tell you to do this and you should already know this. You gotta disable resample right here, okay? That's it. So once we have our velocity in here and if you don't know how to do that, you go to, you right click on the clip, go to insert, remove envelope, velocity. Boom, those are for all you noobs out there. So this is what I do. One click right here, we're gonna make this 50, 50, Put another one, maybe have it go to like 166. And then 300. And it's it's gonna, okay, before I start singing, it's gonna be different for whatever you're doing, whatever song, it's always gonna be different and you're always gonna sync different. I'm just gonna show you guys how I do it and you guys can see. So up a little more slow. And then right here cut that out and then we want it to look clean though not like too fast but not too slow okay okay and then this is what I do right here so he's nowhere near killing the guy as you can see obviously but this is what we're gonna make it do we're gonna cut that, and then we're gonna go to the clip where he killed, where he's about to shoot, right here, right there. So he's about to shoot. We're gonna cut that. Boom! Drag it over here. Now we're gonna make this 50 again, and then we always do fast fade, depending, depending on if it looks good. Yeah, this is looking fire already. So here's a little preview. Yes, sir. So basically, same concept. Wherever we have those gun sounds, we just want to cut the clip to where he's killing the people, obviously, you know. But you want it to look nice. Boom. It's 
So same thing. You guys see what I'm doing. So right there, right before he shoots, we cut it. Boom, 50%, fast fade. That one's, he's too far back. You see how the gun, he's already about to like cock it back. We want to have it like right here. That's when it starts to get slow. It just looks a lot better. Like look, so if I cut this out and did it like this, it's way too fast. You see what I mean? But like this looks a lot better. To me, that looks clean. I know it's a little fast, but this is the song. You know what I mean? If it was a different song, it'd be a little different. But I think it looks dope so far. And another thing that I like to do is... So you see how I have cuts right here every time, right? So there's a cut right here. This is one clip. This is another clip, another clip, another clip. But essentially, it's all the same clip. But basically, what I do is I go to the effects tab. We get some D-Blur. BCC Directional Blur. I have a preset right here. It's called B... It's a little blur, we, we keyframe this. So right here after the first shot, one, two, three, boom. And then we go to the end of the clip, we go one, two, back. Another keyframe, we're in sat zero. And then we go up here. So now we've got two frames, we add that little preset. You can copy my settings right here. Then we go to the other little clip that was next to it. D blur again, okay, B, and then we go to the beginning, one, two, three, boom. Now we go to the end of the clip, go two keyframes back, add one, one, and then one, two, add the preset again. And basically you get the point, you see what I'm doing? I'm doing this for every little cut that I made. So every time that he shoots, it's gonna have a little blur effect. It just adds more cleanness to the shot. I don't know how to explain it, it just looks way better. So now that I did that, we're gonna pre-render this. We're gonna drag all this, shift B, and it'll pre-render and I'll show you guys what it looks like. All right, and that's pretty much it. That's how I sync my clips. I'll zoom into the clips right now so you guys can see it a little better. My other light just died, so I have to move this one on my face now. So throughout this tutorial, if there was anything that you missed or I went a little too fast or you don't understand anything, just comment down below and I'll reply to you and I'll try to help you as much as I can. And also, if you guys want another tutorial on anything, whether it's text or color corrections or Whatever it may be that you want to learn, just comment down below, let me know, and I'm here to help you guys out. I hope you found this helpful, and I hope it does make your edits look a little better. This is the cleanest way to sync, I feel like, because it just gets straight to the point, and it's not like it's too slow or too fast, it's just clean. I hope you guys all enjoyed. Make sure you leave a like if you did, comment down below, and subscribe if you're new. I hope you guys all have a great day, and I'm out. I reach the stars, I grind no balls, I hold my heart, I break my balls, I break my back, I don't look back, I got this far, I'm on my own.